Hey guys, it's Shay from Skull Gaming Network. Welcome to another Retro Bowl video, and today we have the Notre Dame Fighting Irish featured as we do every week on the channel. Now that I'm in the RBCDL, the Retro Bowl College Dynasty League, we're showing the draft, and then I'm showing my one super dominant game. The leagues changed the difficulty from dynamic to medium, so I'm playing on medium. I'll admit, medium is pretty easy. But I had a 78-3 to win on medium, so that's what you're going to see. I forgot I had the draft, so I signed a free agent before the draft. I probably would not have done that. I would have just taken two defenders with a first-round and second-round pick. But I was able to sell my second-round pick for a couple coaching credits, so it worked out okay in the end. We're going to have four players on offense and eight on defense for this season. We've got a quarterback, two wide receivers, our all-American tight end Cameron Bradley, and then eight defenders. We hit Jarrell Oluwakun first play of the game on the pass. And with the new stamina update, the first play of the game, all these guys have burners. So that's an easy touchdown. It's 6 nothing. We get the two. It is eight. Zero Notre Dame. Washington fumbles. We're back on offense. And we're looking to Cameron Bradley. That is caught. That is a 20 yard touchdown. And what is it? 73 seconds into the game. We're up 16 0. That's pretty crazy. Washington, they punt. We're back on offense with over a minute left in the first quarter. We're taking a deep shot to Oluokun. That's caught. That's a gain of 22. Not bad. Not bad. And then that is Cameron Bradley. We're going to try to strafe out of this. He battles. He gets out of it. How does he get out of that? And he's going to turn that into a 30-yard touchdown. What? He should have been tackled like eight times. We go for two. We get it. It's 24 nothing with 34 seconds left in the quarter. We get the ball to start the second quarter after forcing a turnover. We throw it top of the screen, get four plus yards at second and six. We hit Bradley inside the 10 down at about the five. First and goal. And that is caught for a touchdown. It's 30 to nothing. Going for two. Jammed, incomplete. So it stays 30 0. Washington punts. We get the ball back. 207 left in the second quarter. We go over the top. Sweezy caught. Inside the 25, inside the 20, inside the 15, inside the 10, inside the 5. Tackled at the 2 for a gain of 48. He used to be slow with no stamina. Now he's only going to be slow later in the game. We get the touchdown. It's 36-3. We get the two. It's 38. Or sorry, 38-0. Why did I think there was three? I don't know. We're dominating. Back on offense with over a minute left still. Sweezy caught big stiff arm. Jumps a tackle inside the 20, inside the 15, inside the 10, inside the 5. That's a touchdown of 59 yards. It's 44-0. We're going for two. And I probably had Sweezy at the top, but we get it to the tight end Bradley. It's 46-0. Washington runs out the half. They throw a pick to start the second half. We're on offense. We're taking a deep shot. We just overthrew it. We just overthrew it, or that would have already been 54 nothing. Instead, second down, we hit a Luakun. We're down at the four, gain a 21 first and goal. On first and goal, scanning over the middle, caught touchdown, Sweezy, it's 52-0. Going for two, it's 54 nothing. This is a blowout, baby. This is a blowout. There we go. We gave up the field goal. It's 54-3. to We're back on offense still in the third quarter. That's over the middle. That is caught by Bradley for 15 and a first. On first down, we're looking to Oluakun, top of the screen. Caught, strafe in. Dodged a tackle down to the 30. We've got one play left in the quarter. We'll see what we can do with it. 
A Lua Kuhn caught Strafen inside the 15, jumps a tackle inside the 5, touchdown. It is 60-3. to three. We're going for 2, and we're up 62-3 headed into the 4th quarter. This is bonkers. Washington punts. 2.30 left. We get the ball back. We're going to Bradley on the tight end wheel route. That is another 17 yards for him and a first down. On first down, we're looking deep. That was gutsy. We get it to Sweezy inside the five. Touchdown, Jay Sweezy. 38-yard strike. It's 68-3. to three. Going for two, and it is 70-3. to three. The Fighting Irish. Washington, they punt. We have the ball back with a minute 25 left. What else can we do? Bradley caught 17 more yards and a first down. The tight ends are too wide open. Going deep. We got it to Sweezy. He caught it right before he curled back inside the 10, inside the 5 touchdown. 49 yards out. It's 76 to 3 going for 2. It's 78 to 3. Washington, they punt. We get the ball 7 seconds left. Can we get one more score? Can we get 86, which would be a personal record? It's caught. It's caught. We have a chance inside the 20, inside the 15. I tried strafing and we're down at the 12 as time expires and we win 78 to three and that was against Boise State in one of our few head-to-head games so a win by 75 my second best win only to an 80-0 win my best win for YouTube and to conclude this week's Notre Dame video we are 6-0 we won our other games 38-6 40 that was jumping around 40-9 40-16 and 56-21 that gives us a differential of 239 through six weeks. I played a day early, so I get a two-point bonus to put me at 241. And I've used zero restart so far. I got all of my scores on first tries. So that means I get 50 more points at this point for not using any restarts. And I don't plan to use any. So the team's looking in pretty good shape. A quick stat recap. Clifton Custis. 2,485 yards, 39 touchdowns. He has thrown two picks. Terrell Aluakun, 1,018 yards, 14 touchdowns. Jay Sweezy, 1,047 yards, 20 touchdowns. Johnson Knapp, 59 tackles. 66 tackles for Connor Adams. 61 tackles, a pick, and a sack for Craig Hull. 32 tackles, a pick, and a sack for Case Sudfeld. 63 tackles for O'Shea Bosher, 73 for Xavier Webster, 78 and a pick for Vincent Klein, 37 for Henry Garduck, Cameron Bradley, who's hurt, 362 yards, 5 touchdowns. We'll need to get him more involved. And that is it for the team and for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did. If you're new around here, subscribe for more Retro Bowl content. Again, the RBCDL is a college dynasty league for FBS teams based on Twitter. It's pretty fun. If you want any info, let me know in the comments, and I will pass along info on the league and how to join. But other than that, it's been real. It's been fun. I hope you enjoyed. I'm Jay from Skull Gaming Network. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, and as always, peace out.